Customer satisfaction is at an all-time low, so we're introducing a predatory consumer rating scale. You're currently at 4.5 stars. That's excellent, right? Out of eight. But I thought I was the agency's golden goose. You are. But what better motivation is there to save the world than artificially deflating your self-worth? Saving the world? Also, I'm legally obligated to mention that we care about your mental health, so take some time off if you need. Unpaid, of course. And you know, terrorism never sleeps. Thanks. That helps a little, I think. Now, who's taking the tax deduction on this power lunch? Me or me? I'll let you have it if you pique my morbid curiosity. What happens to agents with the lowest satisfaction scores? What a disappointing performance. It's almost as if you wanted us to catch you, Twilight. Can't believe I'm being thrown under the bus for the new guy. Don't sell yourself short. The secret police are the best in the world. I was simply no match. So, I'll be taking my plea bargain and ticket to your coziest gulag. No, 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 please. Make yourself comfortable, Mr. International Super Spy. Partake in one of our finest Russian imports. A legend like yourself has earned the company of another. I'll leave the rest to you, Yuri. You really should relax, friend. We know you're not Twilight. Wait, so I can just leave? You're clear in the eyes of our government, but not with me. What year is it? Current year! What year was it yesterday? Uh, this is a prank, right? Who is Yori Yadyarozu? That's you! That's you, right? It's Briar. And if you wish to leave this plot of thorns in one piece, you'll tell me everything you do know. You won't get anything out of me! But I am contracted to ask you how you would rate your experience with our espionage so far. Four. Only four? Out of five? You got caught. But I felt generous after hearing the news of my wonderful darling sister's marriage. It's out of eight! Goodness, your employer doesn't seem obligated to say they care about your mental health at all. Thanks, man. It's nice to know that I'm not the only one who- What the f*** are you watching? There's no swears or sex, it's fine. Is it? It seems rather violent for a cartoon. Yo, back me up here. TV's making everyone violent these days, right? Big trouble in Little Forger family, y'all. Yuri's coming to visit. The war hero? I, I mean, who's Yuri? My annoying little brother. He's coming over to touch all my stuff, I bet. You didn't tell me you had a brother. Oh, I... For Gore. I'm going to say this multiple times throughout the evening and make it a thing. Thank you for warning us, dear. If he finds out this marriage is fake, he's gonna be so annoying. We gotta make our home look more romantic! Ew! Quick, finish the Lego Death Star! Go, go on, on you go! Go, go, go on, on you go! go! I am not ages 10 and Yamcha! How romantic. A dead child in the middle of our living room. Yeah. I told Debbie what it and that makes me feel frustrated and small, so I'm gonna break this piece of property I have access to until you open up! So annoying! Good evening, my wonderful, sweet, adorable sister. I'm sorry these roses are so meager, but I simply couldn't fit the whole world like you deserve into this tiny, cramped apartment this stranger trapped you in. Oh, they'll look just lovely in our garbage bin. <laughs> Apologies for making myself a stranger. Between work and domestic life, I simply haven't had the time to make your acquaintance. No time for my darling sister, too, I bet. Like you find the time to shower? You reek of cigarettes and bacon. You work at a butchery? He works for the police. Same difference. I work to protect you. Protect me? I'm the one who raised you, remember? <sighs> and you still grew up a pig. And I repay that debt in blood. Of innocent people you find suspicious? Shut up, enjoy the charcuterie, and then leave. I can't accept this. Sorry, we don't have a trough for you to eat straight out of. No, this marriage. Why did you not tell me? I... for gore? Your cute catchphrases will not distract me this time. I for gore. Oh, well, if you insist. Why don't you just tell him the truth, Yor? Being a single woman is so highly suspicious these days, we simply had to expedite our nuptials. Your brother may be a cop, but he'd understand as your only blood relative. Yor and I are not blood related. Ours is a bond much deeper. 
wouldn't that be so gross? Being blood related to a cop? Prove it! You got a DNA kit on hand? Always, among many other invasive kits, but I want proof that you two are truly in love! Can you not see the completed LEGO Death Star before you, sir? <laughs> Don't trust him, Gandalf! <laughs> you never bought me a LEGO Death Star! So you could shoot Endor? You wouldn't be half the narc you are today if I hadn't spoiled you growing up. Eon! If only there was a national tragedy, I could just set a perimeter around and take the credit for bravery from other first responders. Or something. Yuri, I'm home! S sis Why are you so late? And why are you covered in blood? It's not my blood. Also, look, I got you Paw Patrol! I will cherish it like a pipe. But there is one true token of your love that cannot be shared with any other man! Or woman! Kiss. Kiss? Calm down, Lloyd. You've kissed men, women, and politicians on other missions. This should be no different. I'm gonna get drunk for this. <laughs> now let's slop spit before I become a vommy mommy. Oh my gosh, am I really that bad? Oh my gosh, she's not really gonna... Look, sis! I got a perfect score in my criminal psychology exam! Yuri, you're six years old. Can't they teach you anything useful like taxes? <sighs> but good grades are still worth the reward. <laughs> I'm gonna marry you when I grow up! <laughs> good luck! I'm never getting married. 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 I'm gonna have 60 cats! But you say... YOU CAN'T DO THIS! Oh gosh, I can't do this! <laughs> What's that? That you, Son Goku? Yeah, you better run. I see how it is. You're going to treat me like this. All because you have a new favorite! <laughs> you should see the last guy she hit. Lloyd. Forger, you may lay claim on my sister's lips for now. You'd say something even creepier if you didn't lose so much blood. I'm calling a taxi. But if I find out you've been deceiving her, you'll be in multiple worlds of trouble, you hear me? What? I'm just admiring how close you two are. Gross! I never had siblings of my own, and well, thank you for protecting your up until now. What? And if you don't mind, I'd like to call you my brother. Gross! That would also make you your sister and... Oh gosh, I am suddenly struck by self-awareness. Leaving so soon? Feel free to visit whenever you like. I'm sure Anya would love to meet you. And watch you two kissing all the time? No thanks! But maybe for Anya, she seems cool. Good night! Ow! See, honey? You deter more pigs with honey than vinegar. Aren't you a little too old to be having a sister complex? Go home to your family! We don't need you on the night shift! It seems only disgustingly honest men like Lloyd Forger get to have a family. It's never too late to find a gal you can be honest with. Or oh, man! A guy like me, after what I've done. Someone with comparable experiences. Who was that tall girl in Korea you worked with? It was, uh... Don't say her name! Nana! <laughs> I told you not to say her name! Nana! Nana 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 nana! If women fluster you so badly, then let's concentrate on our work. So the world can be safe for them. Safe from men like Agent Twilight. Now there's a guy who deserved to rot alone. Hmm. Crazy night, huh, Jack? You've been asleep for 16 hours. Yeah, I gotta settle down. I feel great, all things considered. Perhaps I'm developing a tolerance. Yeah, that might not be a good thing. Or perhaps she was exaggerating the alcohol intolerance all this time. It may not be the only thing exaggerated. Does she truly despise her brother? Or was that a distraction while I willingly let a government officer probe our ho- God damn! You can't afford to settle down, Twilight. The mission still takes precedent. But how would your feel if she found out I didn't trust her? But what if I'm right? You've got some shit on you. Oh, uh, thank you. Thought he was trying to kiss me again. And no amount of alcohol is going to make me forget that. But now that I think about it, Lloyd's been acting weird ever since. 
Maybe he's disappointed in me now. Well, fake or not, I'm not exactly the model wife. I don't kiss, I set a bad example for Anya, and my extended family's annoying. It's reasonable for him to regret our arrangement. You there! <gasps> the secret police! We'd like to ask you some questions, Fraulein. Uh, I'm married! To Lloyd Forger, we know. Because we're the secret police, and if you have any dirt on him, you better tell us now, or... Call my lawyer. Huh? You can't call for a lawyer. You're not under arrest. Then what exactly are we doing here, boys? We're intimidating you. Oh. Well, pro tip, the Girl Scout uniforms aren't helping. But I bet you'll get your bugling badge soon, Daisy. I'm rooting for you. You got us Girl Scout uniforms? That's all I had lying around on short notice. You have Girl Scout uniforms lying around, Frankie? You know how difficult it is to accept you as a, a human? Yuri Briya. <sighs> Did he put you up to this? We suspect you've been collaborating with him. Sources say you aren't even blood related. So one might suspect you to have a secret arrangement? A little domestic infiltration and intel gathering in exchange for protection from the government's most powerful branch? He was left on my doorstep as an infant with only a note to call him Yuri. But I raised him to be a kind, sweet, trusting boy! Stop playing dumb and tell us the truth! Ow, 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 ow. Got me on the whooshy finger hold! That is, until men like you filled his head with fears over enemies who don't even exist. You're putting your family at risk acting like this. At risk from who? The government's most powerful branch? Your weak, rotten men who sow distrust as a sad, last-ditch attempt at maintaining power. <laughs> If you're really planning to lock me up and harm my family, then you better bring more men. Or women. Clearly, we've made a mistake. Don't expect any apologies from us, but we are contracted to ask how many stars you would rate this interrogation. You'll be seeing stars when I'm through with you. Run! <laughs> <laughs> I'm charging you and the agency for workplace injury. Come on now, I don't need your pity, I just need your insurance number. It's not that. Oh, you feel guilty over her. I'm warning you, man. If you value your job, and more importantly, your life, trust nobody. But she was truly prepared to fight for us. I was really prepared to risk it all, and to what end? The forgers would be ruined. Oh, hey, you're... Lloyd? What a coincidence. Why don't we walk home together? Oh, one sec, there's some more shit. I'm so sorry. Apparently, I'm such a disappointment as a wife, I can't even maintain proper appearances. Well, if you ask me, you're... While it is admirable to do one's best, it's worthless if you lose yourself becoming someone else's ideal. Who the f*** took this picture? Have you ever felt that way, Lloyd? Me? Well, no. But I do know others like this in my line of work. And suffice to say, as I've gotten to know you better, I... Adore you for who you truly are, Yor. Thank you, Lloyd. I never imagined myself getting married, but I'm glad it's with you. Your rating has reached a record high, Twilight, and the last customer you interrogated left a $5 tip, which we'll take our cut of. She really didn't have to. Oh, should I send her a thank you note, or...? Don't tell me you feel guilty for doing your job. And what if I am? It might affect your rating. The agency knows my true worth. And if it doesn't, well, I wouldn't want to compete with me. Indeed it does. But let me warn you, Twilight. The competition out there is... stiff. One MacGuffin hold the mayo as requested. You do your job well, Wolf. Care to take another? That depends. How much does it pay and how much trouble can I cause along the way? If you'd like top secret early access to all of our parodies and more, consider supporting us on Patreon. Remember to subscribe, and thanks for keeping Joyride's engine burning.